start this problem, I really want you to start, I really want you to think about this a little bit logically. So it's saying n plus 4 divided by n minus 3 must equal 0. One rule to keep in mind is that the denominator when you're dividing can never be 0 because if the denominator is 0, then the an answer is actually undefined. So the only way this answer will be 0 is if my numerator, that value right there is 0. So what can I make n over here? So my numerator becomes zero, because remember, I'm doing n plus four. And if you think about that, then n must be negative four, because negative four plus four is zero, and zero divided by any number is gonna give me zero. So my answer here is negative four, but hold on, before you exit this video, let's talk about this a little more. Now, if I had a zero in the denominator, or n was three, then that would give me an undefined number. So keep those couple things in mind this way. And then the other thing that I wanna check out here is imagine, remember, there's, an, there's a one down there. So if there's a one down there, What else, the other thing that I can do in this problem is cross multiply. n minus three times zero and one times n plus four. So n minus three times zero is just zero and one times n plus four is just n plus four. So I have n plus four equals zero and to solve for n, I'll subtract both sides by four. So n would equal negative four. So no matter how you look at it, the answer should be negative four, but it is always nice to kind of just take a step back at a problem, make sure you understand what's happening. Because if you can logically understand what's happening, what they're testing you on, it'll, it'll help you better get to the answer.